What's up everyone, welcome to your 7th After Effects tutorial. And in this tutorial, it's going to be real quick, I just want to teach you guys about something called Scale. And what this does is make your objects grow and shrink. So, if you uh, were watching my last tutorial, I show you guys how to make your objects fade in and out. So, let's go ahead and any keyframes that are in your opacity, let's just go ahead and get rid of them. Just highlight them and press delete. And to get out of opacity, just highlight your um, object, whatever object you're working on, and press S. This will change it from whatever it was to scale. Again, that's S for scale. Highlight your object, press S. From here, we want to go press home on your keyboard. This will bring you to the first frame in your animation. And go ahead and click the stopwatch to make sure that there's a box around it. Once there's a box around it, as you know if you've been watching my last tutorials, now we can begin editing the keyframes. If there's not a box around it and you try to edit keyframes, it won't work. So click it and make sure there's a box around it. The first thing that we're gonna actually the first thing that we're gonna go over is these numbers right here. This is your X scale right here. X means how wide your object is. And the Y means how tall your object is. So if you want to make it grow one way or another, you have to edit one of these. But what I'm going to keep mine on is um, this. This little chain right here means that your um, aspect ratio is locked. That means whenever you're editing scale, whenever you edit one of these, the other one changes with it. So your object is always proportional. If you have this unlocked, then whenever you change one of these numbers, your object is only going to grow uh, width or height. It's not going to grow proportional like um, to scale. So make sure if you want your object to grow proportional and just don't want it to grow taller or wider, then make sure this chain is locked. So since we're on our very first keyframe, the first thing that I'm going to want to do is I'm going to want to shrink Sammy. since we're gonna be wanting him to grow so go ahead and click on any of these values and I'm gonna change it to 10 and as you can see Sammy shrunk to 10 percent and also the Y value shrunk with it this is because as I was talking about the aspect ratio is locked the next thing I'm gonna want to do is move my current time indicator to about three seconds now I'm gonna tell After Effects alright at the very beginning I want him to be 10% but at 3 seconds I'm gonna change this value I'm gonna want him to be um, let's go 60% now as you can see Sammy grew to 60% again 10 at the beginning 60 at the end so let's go to the beginning again let's go ahead and press space and watch what Sammy does as you can see, he gradually grows from 10 to 60%. And that is how you edit scale in After Effects. So again, go to the keyframe, change the value of scale. And another way that you can change the value, let me work on this keyframe. Another way that you can change the value is again, scrub these values, click and drag to the left or right, and as you can see, Sammy is now shrinking and growing. So let's uh, scrub this value down to 10. Make another keyframe at the beginning. Scrub it all the way up to about 100. And one last time, let's see what Sammy can do. Press space, grow, shrink. One more time, grow, shrink. Sammy the Sausage, ladies and gentlemen. So that is how you change scale in After Effects. I hope you guys learned it. Pay attention to how you scrub the values in scale. And once you learn everything I cover in this tutorial, then you're ready to move on to the next tutorial. So thank you guys for watching, and I'll see you next time.